Good morning. Our hymn today is entitled, My Redeemer. In Him we have redemption through His blood, the forgiveness of sins, in accordance with the riches of God's grace that He lavished on us with all wisdom and understanding. Ephesians 1, 7 and 8. Although this is a great praise and worship hymn, it was born out of tragedy. In fact, it was never sung by its composer. Philip P. Bliss had gone to his childhood home in Rome, Pennsylvania to visit his mother. En route from that Christmas celebration in 1876, he and his wife were returning home by train when the railroad bridge near Ashtabula, Ohio collapsed. Their train plunged into a ravine 60 feet below and caught fire. Only 14 of the 160 passengers survived. Philip escaped the fiery train through a window, but returned to rescue his wife. They both perished in this tragic accident. Neither body was ever found. At age 38, this ended his height of fruitful ministry. Earlier, he had written such hymns as Almost Persuaded, Hold the Fort, it is well with my soul and wonderful words of life. His manuscript for this hymn, My Redeemer, was found in his trunk in the wreckage of the train. Shortly after his death, James McGranahan composed the music for Philip's text, and it first appeared in print in 1877 in a collection for Sunday schools. However, Philip and his wife Lucy went to see their Redeemer before ever hearing others sing the hymn about Jesus, my Redeemer. Please come back next week on Thursday for another hymn. And if you're enjoying these hymns, uh, why don't you just share it with your friends? That way we can share this wonderful message to more people about Jesus, who is our Redeemer, and they can, He can be their Redeemer as well.